and I believed that I could fix it and we could improve the business. If you're going into a turnaround situation, you have to have a pretty clear plan what you're going to do. Every business needs a strong team. Uh, it's not about individuals, it's about teamwork. This was a company that had a significant market position, had been rebranded, but was badly run. And I believed that I could fix it and we could improve the business. Uh, and that was the attraction for me. Uh, if you're going into a turnaround situation, you have to have a pretty clear plan what you're going to do before you get there. And for me, it was quite simple. It was ensure that we could sell the appropriate number of holidays profitably, and in our industry, too much capacity gives you huge problems, to ensure that we bought our hotel capacity in the most efficient way with the right numbers at the right price, to have a cost structure that was appropriate for the size of the business, and you put those elements together, which is all about the operational integrity of the business. That was the plan, and that's what we executed immediately. And it was very clear to everybody what we were doing. And I think clarity is also important in terms of execution. Yeah. Every business needs a strong team. Uh, it's not about individuals, it's about teamwork. What you normally find in any business, there are some great operational people. And that's what I found. Uh, and the problem was at the, at the senior leadership in terms of the wrong direction that, that, that the business was, being, uh, was going in. And therefore, strong internal colleagues supplemented by bringing in some very important people and probably the most important recruit at that time and it was interesting, Nick, because you had brought the person in just before I joined was Richard Prosser. Mm. And he made a huge difference because he understood overseas and the whole overseas operation. He and I talked the same language straight away. Well, the industry needed to consolidate and how would we participate in that consolidation? And our view was very clear that we would either sell our mainstream business, the first choice business, and keep the specialist portfolio, or there was only one merger candidate for us. Mm. And what happened in terms of the sequence of events, and as you quite rightly said, one potential buyer, or in fact two potential buyers in the form of Thomas Cook and Air Tours, decided to merge. And therefore they were neither were potential buyers. But what happens in an industry when it consolidates, one move often creates another move. And the other move, which would not have happened without the initial uh, consolidation of Thomas Cook and Air Tours, was TUI and First Choice mm. merging and creating Europe's leading tourism business. Yeah. Uh, and that was absolutely the right move for us. Uh, and yeah, we played a major role in consolidation. And we twin tracked each other through the competition process. They were about four weeks in front of us. Uh, that's not for the faint hearted when you're going from four to two in terms of how a regulator may react. But because the industry had changed so much and particularly with the growth of online carriers, they said actually, this is not going to be in any way against the consumer because there's so many alternatives in terms of how you create a holiday. Yeah. Two is big. Um, maybe I say it's not that complex because I've had 30 years in the industry. It's broken down in, in, into very clear business units and therefore we have some very big leaders. I mean when you look at some of our divisional CEOs they could be PLCs in their own right. Yeah. Uh, and that's how we run with a very flat structure uh, and, 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 and a very important, strong divisional structure. Uh, and that makes the business very manageable. Uh, and we are, we, our aim is to uh, 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 avoid complexity. Because if, if you ever say to someone, well, it's all very difficult, this is a very complex business, people say, well, why? Uh, we, so our business, it's all about scale, big power brands, it's not about complexity. Yeah.